So guys, welcome back to another video. Um, yeah, another video like this, but mm, at least you guys get to hear the audio, I guess. So um, yeah. So today we're going to be talking about Bryce Harper now. If you've watched a couple bit videos before this, like the Friday checkup, um, you will know that um, I don't really like the idea of Bryce Harper to the Yankees. I know there was a mid-season where he went to first base and the shaving the beard thing, and, but I don't really think that, I don't really think that I I don't think we need Harper. You know, like it. I guess it kind of depends on your views on the Yankees. It's just we don't we already have so many guys in the outfield. I mean, let's just list off a couple. We have Gardner, we have Hicks, we have Judge, we have Frazier, you know, like, just to name a few. Like, do we really need any more? You know? And I think the answer to that is... No, we don't we don't need that. Like why would we want that? Like hold on. Let's look at the Yankees season rankings. They're sixteenth in batting average, which I think they have to work on. But um seventh in on base, second in runs, first in home runs, second in slugging. Tenth and earn run at earn run average or ERA should just say, but um, batting average against the seven. You know, like um. I guess it really depends on how you look at the Yankees from, like, from your, like, um, from your angle, but I don't, I just, again, I can't see why the Yankees really need, you know, why they really need Harper, like, if you look on the team stats, we already got batting average, okay? We got fairly okay batting average. Hits. Good amount of hits. Um, runs, this is a big factor for the Yankees. Giancarlo Stanton, 106. RBIs, Stanton 101, home run, Stanton 39, Judge, Judge, he should have, he, he, I think he could have, um, led, led the league, I mean, whatever, the Yankees didn't have that many stolen bases this year, 16 was the top, Slugging percentage, Luke Voigt, six fifty one. No, we don't. We don't need. Technically, if you think about it, we don't need any other players. I mean, um, let's go to. Let's see what this is here. Um, the Yankees are the favorites to win the World Series in twenty nineteen. Mm, I saw this whole thing. I didn't really make a thing about it. With spring training, 
among us, their uh, odds makers are already doing their thing, apparently. They're already making predictions. Um, Bet Online, okay, has made their 2019 World Series odds. Okay, probably shouldn't have said that name. Um, the Yankees are one, are one in six. So, yeah. Then, uh, the Red Sox and the Astros are right behind them. Then the Dodgers and the Phillies behind them by a good bit. So, but I mean, we don't really, we can't really predict anything. Because, like, um, remember how, um, how the, uh, Dodgers were doing really bad. And then all of a sudden they had this series in Pittsburgh and they just did amazing. Like, so you can't really go off the predictions, so, I mean, you know, I don't really know, but, um, I will say right now, um, just for kind of news around the league, um, Max Kepler did sign, uh, I think it was five year, 40 million, I, I don't know, um, I will find out um, by watching uh, MLB Network, but um, and um, I will see um, what uh, I'll see um, what it is, and I'll comment it on the video. I'll, I'll make a comment on this video saying what it is. So uh, yeah. See you guys.